Good morning, you waste Mike. Thought I'd give you an update on the Three Stooges over here. Um, that's the, uh, let me get out of the thing there. Oh, how am I going to do this? There we go. This is the second run. I, uh, did the first batch last night. Uh, about midnight I came down and cleaned those filters out. So, I filled this up last night. <clears throat> I had to use my little syringy thingy here to just, you can see what a, the white is right there. That's how much acid was still in there. So I just pulled that out with the syringe so I can get all that. See how thick that gets? It clogs up the filters pretty good. This one here, uh, pretty much the same way. Still some acid in there. And this one here, man, this stupid light's in the way, I guess. I don't know. But, but that's all gold in there. Sorry about the shadow. I don't know if it's my arm, but this one here. And then I, this is what I had to take out of the three of them, was this much. So, half a cup. But there's still a lot of gold in there. Floating around. Uh, let's see, anything on the bottom, yeah, see it all on the bottom there. So, I'll just put a new filter in there, and I'll just take this, put it in there, and it'll run through real quick. And then this was that bucket. I put water in here yesterday. And, uh, oh, man, I have a bad shoulder. It hurts to lift stuff. So, that's kind of cool looking, actually. Looks like clouds in there. But this has got a ton of gold in it yet. I mean, Give it a swisheroo. Swisheroo. See if we can see some gold in there. Let's go in the bucket again. You guys like it in here. This is mainly just water and you can see some gold floating in there, but there's a lot in the bottom. Um gold is like eight times heavier than water, so uh the gold kinda stays to the bottom. Just, there's some there floating around, but there's a lot of gold in there yet. So I got to still do that. Um, even though that's just water, because there's gold and there's, um, they're called uh, MLCCs. That I should have took off of those, but I didn't because I'm lazy. Which is these middle pieces. That's what's making the acid so thick. I didn't scrape those off. Usually I do. So, that's my problem. I, I didn't do it the right way because I was being lazy. So, But, yep, that's how you do that. Um, I'm going to rinse these out real quick. And then what I do is I just take the, uh, the old the acid that I filtered and I put it into a jug. And I reuse it. Yeah, I know. No gloves, but I'm not really touching the acid, so I should be alright. You just pour it in there until it overflows on your hand. Like that. Brilliant. Eh? Am I a dedicated guy or what? I'll show you how to kill yourself doing this. Oh. Let's put the cap back on there. I'm doing it left-handed, too. <laughs> alright. So now I'm going to clean that mess up real quick. Still no gloves. And what's cool about this, if you take water and you spray it on there, it actually neutralizes it like instantly. And my damn cat just came down here and took a crap, so now it smells really nice down here. Dumbass. She always, always does that when I'm down here doing something. There, so now I can touch it and move around. A little bit on the floor, a little bit on the counter. There we go. Spray it all. We don't. We don't care. Here at Eways, Mike's. Uh, I might have to call Hazmat here in a minute. Good thing they're only two blocks away. But that's what I do with that. But what I'm going to do with the rest of these is. Uh, Dump them all into one. This is special coffee brew for Mickey XOXO. She likes her coffee. 
I got you. There. So now this I will put over here. There. Oh, you know what? I never checked this stuff. This here should be. This was just a couple of weird ram fingers that I had. Yeah, you freaking stink. Uh, I don't know. I can't see in there. I'll deal with that later, too. I have to go to that burnt restaurant and pick up that stainless steel stuff for the guy. And then the rest of the day, I'm going to be down here. Uh, so what I do is I just take my spray bottle. And if you'll... The green is the acid that's on the filter, but once you spray it, it dilutes it. So it's, just, <clears throat> it's just a way to be able to touch the uh, filter. I mean, I have put my hands in that acid. It's just not a smart thing to do. I do it only if something falls in that shouldn't be in there. I don't put, you know, I don't go elbow deep or anything like that, but sometimes I spur the moment. You do it not thinking. So, a little bit of noise, guys. Hold on. Let's see if this is going to work or not. Come on, baby. That's a lot of thick gold in there. But what that'll do, that'll clean the gold and, um, oh, you know what, I can use this. This is just water with, see all the gold in there? That's all gold under there. But I can just pour that in there. There you go. There's a good, good picture of it. And that's all gold. It's between, the gold on these things. I think is between like 10 and 12 carat, something like that. But when you do it like this, and you uh, get all the impurities, you know, most of the impurities out of it, the closest I can get, because I don't use the nitric acids and the, uh, there's other chemicals that they use, um, I can get 95, 96 uh, percent pure, which is pretty good for just, you know, backyard refiners, so to speak. Uh, refiners can get 90, my refiner, I think, the highest he got was 99.6, 99.7 on mine. So, that's with the, the chips and stuff I sell. So, but I'll just let that settle and, um, I can actually, like, take just, this just water that's in here. But I can, instead of spraying it, I can just dump this in here. And it'll neutralize the, uh, filter as well. Most of it, anyway. And it was... Well, there ain't a pot under there. That was almost a catastrophe. So I'll just let them sit until I come back from getting that other stuff. And, um, I'll get to work on this stuff. I want to try to get it all filtered and, uh, dry it out so I can do a, a video on dissolving it and, you know, getting it all done so I can show you guys. Cloudy day today, but it's not bad. I think it's like 40 right now. Uh, it's supposed to be 50s, I think low 50s this afternoon. This is my hillbilly walkway, what do you think? This is uh, the back of flat screen TV. So, alright guys, I'll talk to y'all later. Have a good one.